and welcome to the Hard Luck Blues Show. My name is E.C. White, a.k.a. Hard Luck, and we got an interesting show coming up uh, this week for you. We're going to talk about some of the uh, local blues artists here in Memphis, Dr. Feel Good Potts, Miss Bertha Payne, uh, and a host of others that's on uh, pre-recorded stuff that we had did. So we're going to send some shout-outs to uh, to D's down at the Blues Club. I went by there and uh, had some of that good barbecue and uh, check his fish out uh Judy, we're going to say hello to Judy over at the uh, phone doctor, I believe it is. So go by and tell Judy my wife was talking about her. I won't tell you what I said, but uh, I talked about her. Uh, we're going to talk about uh, my radio show. I've been talking about everything and leaving me out. I want you guys to check out the uh, Hard Luck Blues show, YoHits.com. That comes on every Thursday, all day Thursdays and Saturdays, uh, 8 to 2. That's the Hard Luck Blues Show. So uh, don't forget me on that. And so many other people that have uh, hit me up here at the uh, Hard Luck Blues Show. So I want you guys to uh, just keep me in mind. And don't forget to get those thumbs up. When you check my video out, give us give us those thumbs up on that side. You'll see it and let us know you've uh, watched it and everything. And it's the Hard Luck TV show. You can get this show, Comcast 31, every Saturday night. That's midnight, Saturday night, Sunday morning. Don't forget it. Going into early Sunday morning. So uh, we just look forward to... Uh, so many wonderful people that's been tuning in and hitting me up. Uh, trying to think of the uh, young man from um, Jonesboro, Arkansas. With the uh, he got a real place there in Jonesboro. Uh, Legends, I believe it is. Legends Barbecue there in Jonesboro. So I want to thank everybody. So this is. Uh, my time. I'm kind of like Gerard Rayborn, big show coming uh, Saturday night, the 24th. Don't forget this will probably be doing his show time. You get this, but uh, hope you guys uh, support uh, one of our very own, Mr. Gerard Rayborn. And want to thank the podcast center that's been so kind to me here at the uh, Heart Luck Blues show. So uh, we've been enjoying it and uh, a lot of special guests out there that's been supporting me and uh, J.R. Blue, Gerard Rayborn, uh, Charles Kaysen, the thing we did with Big Jerry, uh, Miss Sandra Johnson, I believe it's Sarah Johnson. Yeah, better get that name right. So I want you guys to just keep supporting us here at the Hard Luck Blue Show. We welcome you to the Blue Spot. I'm E.C. White. Get the best blues in Memphis every Saturday morning on the Hard Luck Blues Show. And listen to your local artists on your hit radio. Hi, I'm E.C. White and you're watching the Blues Spot. The new debut album from J.R. Blue on Gabaret Records. It's Heart and Soul featuring the debut single. Amazing. It's J.R. Blue on Gabriel Records. The new debut album, Heart and Soul. Get yours you, at all participating outlets. Get yours I, today. I want you. 
Good evening, Mr. Murray. How are you? I'm fine. How are well, you this evening? Great, great. Welcome to Memphis and knock them out tonight. Hey, so, we're uh, going to be trying our best. Uh, tell us something about Mr. Jojo Murray and, uh, and his uh, music. Well, Jojo Murray, old country boy from Shelby, Mississippi. Oh, my. Right down the road there on Highway 61. You know where it is. Yeah, I started playing music at a real early age. I started singing in nightclubs uh, at the age of 15. Mm hmm and uh, I moved to Chicago, 1964. Okay. Joined a few bands, played here and there. And my first recording was like uh, 1971. Mm -hmm. I had a song called Why Baby, and that was the A side and the B side. It was a whole lot of woman. Yeah. And uh, it didn't do too much, you know. Okay. Okay. Yeah. Um. What brought you to Memphis, and, and uh, are you touring much, or what's going on with your tour? As well, we're getting, we're getting some dates booked. Yeah. Well, we haven't done a lot of touring. Yeah. But what brought me to Memphis was Miss uh, Anna Coday. Oh, Coday Records, huh? Yeah, yeah. I met her. I yeah. did a festival in Ben Harbor, Michigan, 2015. Oh, okay. And she was there, and uh, we got to talk and got to know each other, and I presented my record to her, my album, mm -hmm. uh, which was called From the Inside. Okay. This is my titled song. I think it's going to be a big hit. Yeah. And um, from there, we got to know each other and start working together. So that's why I wound up in Memphis, and I'm enjoying it. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I'm really enjoying myself. Well, tell us what inspired Joe Joe Murray to uh, write that From the uh, Inside in uh you know, just a little uh, the inside well, stuff. Well, believe we it or not, not. Yeah. I was sleeping about three o'clock in the morning, <laughs> and I had a dream. This is not just a song; it's a, it was a video. Mm hmm I saw the video in my sleep, so I got up, grabbed my guitar, and I started playing it. Yeah. Putting the words together. Got tired and sleeping. Went back to bed. Got up about seven, eight o'clock in the morning, mm -hmm. and I finished the song. And when I finished it, uh, it really brought a tear to my eye. Well, man, I tell you, we're gonna get a, take a break here, and we're gonna get some more good questions in from Mr. Jojo Murray. Stick and stay, don't go nowhere. From the Windy City, Chicago Blues, the debut album on Cody Records featuring Jojo Murray. His debut single mm -hmm. from the inside. Oh my 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 my, my 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 on Cody Records. It's a sad it's situation. Outlets. It's oh, Joe yeah. Joe Murray. I'm back with Mr. Joe Joe Murray, the blues man himself out of Chicago, Illinois. Is that correct? That's correct. And I Ooh, thank uh, you all for having me. Oh man, just a blessing to be here with you. Uh, who's your uh, biggest influence in the uh, music industry? Bar none. The late, great Sam Cooke. Sam Cooke. Quite a man. That's, that's an influence of that. <laughs> the best that ever did it, yes, as far sir. as I'm concerned. Yeah. yeah. But who am I to say? <laughs> well, hey, that's, that's some powerful stuff. You know, if he'd have had technology back then that we got oh my today. God. Yeah, oh been my awesome. God. Yes. Sam Cooke. Yes, yeah. Sam was the man. Yeah. I was picking cotton, chopping cotton. One day I was chopping cotton. I had one of those little nine volt radios. Mm -hmm. Tennessee Waltz. Oh, yeah. Came, came on. Well, I said, wow. Yeah. Who is that? Yes. Yeah, <laughs> Before him, Jimmy Reed. Jimmy Great, Reed was my favorite. Jimmy Reed. Yeah. yeah. Jimmy Reed was. Is he out of uh, Chicago, uh, or were you in Chicago at that time? Uh, uh, no, I was down in Mississippi. Yeah, okay. You know, when I first heard Sam Cooke uh, and Jimmy Reed, I was, like I said, know picking say. cotton. <laughs> uh, homeboy, Sam Cooke is from Clarksdale, too. from Clarksdale, yeah. Yeah, okay, great, great. Uh, uh, who uh, really uh, influences you more than, uh, than anything? Uh, your uh, Sam Cooke was your... Uh, you know, uh, the most influence I ever had was my mother. Yeah. Because she could sing. 
Oh, okay. Gospel or oh. R&B or secular music type. Gospel. Yeah. yeah. She had that voice. And uh, she's always been there for me, you know. Yeah. While she was alive, she's the best song. Mm-hmm. Okay, great, great. Anything I did, she stood by me 100%. Okay. Whether it went good or bad. Okay, great, great. So, uh, Mr. Jojo Murray, so we are uh, going to take a break, and uh, we'll be right back. So, uh, stick and stay more with Mr. Jojo Murray. Yo Hits Radio, the internet party right in the palm of your hands. Yo Hits Radio, listen and win. Monica Savvy, the morning show, Slim Goody, the afternoon, and the night cruiser flows from 6 p.m. to midnight. It's Yo Hits Radio, blues, gospel, neo soul, R&B, pop, and jazz. Get your app today. It's Yo Hits Radio. Join us and jam. so hard. Look, tell us uh, about how your fans, how the uh, booking people, how do they get in touch with JoJo Murray? Well, Miss Jazzy A mm -hmm. at yeah, End of No, yeah. End of, End of No Radio. Yeah, she's my booking agent. Okay. Yeah, Miss Anna Coday, my record company, Coday Records. Yeah, and. Uh, Mr. Murray, look, uh, thank you. We here at YoHits.com appreciate you. It's TV and uh, radio. We are one of the uh, smaller media companies in Memphis. Thank you for giving us some of your time. And uh, just let us know when you're coming back in town, where you're going from here. So we thank you. Please come back. I appreciate you all so much. And God bless you and keep doing the good work. Well, break a leg tonight, as they say in show business. I'm Thank you for my best. From the Windy City, Chicago Blues, the debut album on Cody Records featuring JoJo Mary. His debut single mm -hmm. from the inside. Oh my it's my my my, my 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 on Cody Records. It's a sad. Situation. Hey, what's going on? My name is Andre Lee, and I want y'all to check out The Blues Show at YoHits.com. I'm E.C. White. Get the best blues in Memphis every Saturday morning on the Hard Luck Blues Show and listen to your local artists on your hit radio. Good evening, good evening. Look who we got here, Miss Anita Love. Hey, tell us something about yourself and your music. Well, how you doing today, Mr. Oh, White? I'm just fine. Well, just good. Fine. I'm, my name is Anita Love, and i uh been singing for a little while. I've been singing in church first. Yeah. And so I started singing the blues mm -hmm. at about maybe, well, I just started singing the blues about, about four years ago. Mm -hmm. So I enjoy it and I like it and, I, and the people love it. Okay. Well, tell us more about your uh, latest release, uh, your well, new CD. Well, my latest release is uh, it's called uh, It's the Weekend. And uh, the, the writer is Mr. Gerard Raven. So okay. we, we, we getting ready to prom, uh, push that this weekend. Okay. But this week. So it should be released should in a little bit. It should be released in about a couple of days. Okay. Uh-huh. Uh, what inspired uh, you to write? Do you write or, or do you have other people to write for well, you? Well, I wrote one song, but I'm, I'm going to get into that. Mm -hmm. But in, right now, I got people to write for me. So uh, I will be getting into that because I've, I've wrote one song and it's called... Um, I can't think of it right Your now. song, Knock Knock? No, Knock Keep Knocking. Okay. Real Man. Real Man, uh, okay. Real Man, and, I okay. Have, and it's a real nice song, so, but I am going to get into that one. Um, are you planning to release a video or, you know, uh, what's coming up for Miss Alita Love? Well, you know, that's, that's, I did, that's a good question. I, um, I am trying to release another video. I do have a video out right now on my single call keep knocking mm -hmm. so it's the weekend i do want to release a video out on that mm -hmm. as well well that's good good mm -hmm. yeah 
Uh, any plans uh, to uh, hit the road, uh, including uh, any tours, uh, uh, concerts? Uh, what's coming up for Anita? Oh, God, I've been... Uh, Dates, in, time, locations, anything? I've been hitting the road for a minute now. I've, I've been going a few places now. I just come from Wichita, Kansas. Oh. You know, and I've been to uh, Little Rock, and I've been to Bahia, Mississippi. I've been, you know, quite a few places, but I'm still looking to grow and go, you know, to bigger places, like, mm -hmm. you know, to spread my love a little bit. Mm, okay, great, great. Hey, uh, we got a couple of more here, and we're going to let you get out of here. Joe Blues Butler, the man that brought you the debut album, Crumb Snatchers, featuring the songs like 40 Acres and a Mule, Party Over Here, and Blues Put a Spell on Me. Joe Blues Butler, with his new debut single, Full Figured Woman, the new debut single from Joe Blues Butler. Get yours at all participating outlets. We are back with Miss Anita Love. And uh, Miss Love, uh, tell us uh, who have you been listening to? You know, that inspires me. Yes. Uh -huh. my, my inspiration comes from a lot of these old school artists. Yeah. I love like Denise LaSalle, Tina Turner, Betty Wright. Those mm -hmm. are my inspired artists. They, they inspire. And we have one here now, Miss Chick Rogers. Oh, oh yeah. God, I love her. Great, great. Yeah. Uh, who makes, uh, who's your uh, biggest influence in the uh, music industry? Well, yeah. my biggest influence is me. Oh, okay, Miss Love. It's me. Yeah, okay. Yeah. Well, hey, look, uh, keep up the good work. We thank you for coming by and sharing this with us this evening. Please come back. And we think, thank you. Thank you so much, Mr. White. The new debut album from J.R. Blue on Capital A Records, it's Heart and Soul, featuring the debut single, Amazing. It's J.R. Blue on Capital A Records. The new debut album, Heart and Soul, get yours at all participating outlets. You get yours that I, today. I want you. Good evening, Mr. Blue. How you doing? I'm doing great. How you E.C. Doing? White, we're here at the uh, Casino Resort in Tunica, Mississippi with J.R. Blue. And this is uh, yourhits.com uh, interview, uh, the Blue Spot. And we like Mr. Blue at this time to uh, tell us something about J.R. Blue and uh, what's going on with you and your new CD. Again, my name is J.R. Blue, and you know I'm, I reside. I'm from Rooville, Mississippi. I'm from the Delta, and uh, I'm a rhythm and blues artist. Uh, I'm not all the way blues, but I, I, I definitely have blues influences because I'm from Mississippi and right in the But I am youth. I am young, so I'm, I'm able to tap into both worlds. Oh yeah. Uh, I, I truly admire my elders, and people back in the days. So I always listen to them, mm -hmm. and I just try to put out. Uh, good music, something that's good quality, um, uh, on a positive outlook, oh, yeah. and I try to keep it alive, the music alive. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yes, sir. Mm -hmm. uh, how about that, uh, your next CD? Uh, 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 I just released, I just released a new album, which is titled Amazing. Amazing. Yeah. Okay. Heart and Soul. Sorry, Heart and Soul, and the single off there is called Amazing. Oh, okay. Man. I could yeah. record here in Memphis out of Royal Studios, as we mentioned. Um, I still been going with the same ingredients. Oh, that is Memphis flavor. Yes, absolutely. Yeah. absolutely. Yeah. I try to surround myself with people who've been there and people who know. Mm -hmm. And I try to sit around and learn as much as I can. Okay. Tell us who must the JR Blue listen to uh, uh, besides JR Blue? Yeah, I, I listen to. Um, I have been listening too much, but I always listen to Sam Cooke. I always oh, listen to wow. Harvin. Yeah. Al Green. I always you know, I'll, I listen to every. I listen to not everybody. I'm not gonna say it. Mm -hmm. I love yeah. everybody um, who's pushing for the music. But I try not to listen to too much because I want to kind of keep my my own identity. Oh yeah, absolutely. Yeah, no doubt about that. Yeah. So uh, you know. Uh, 
we're gonna keep this thing rolling. We're gonna go ahead. I know you gotta go, so we're gonna try to work with you and get through this thing. So, uh, you say you got the. Uh, how's the album doing? The album's doing great. The album's doing okay. great. Um, you know, it's a lot of work, which I, I love. I can't complain about it because I yeah. love and, and you know, we always want to see numbers at the end of the work. Oh yeah, absolutely. but at the yeah, same no time, doubt. at the same time, I I work so hard that I whatever God bless me with, I stand on whatever He bless me with. Oh, yeah, and my main thing truly is to do the right thing and be an inspiration to the youth. Oh, yeah, well, yes, I think you're on the right track. Uh, we're gonna take a little break here. We don't have to pay some bills and try to keep the uh, blue spot uh, on the scene. So we'll be right back with Mr. J.R. Blue. Man, I tell you, I'm the proud C, bro. Yes, sir. I'm E.C. White. Get the best blues in Memphis every Saturday morning on the Hard Luck Blues Show and listen to your local artists on your hit radio. The new debut album from J.R. Blue on Capital A Records, it's Heart and Soul, featuring the debut single, Amazing. It's J.R. Blue on Capital A Records. The new debut album, Heart and Soul. Get yours you, at all participating outlets. You Get yours that I, today. I want you. We're back with J.R. Blue, my main man. Now, I tell you, brother, just just pleasure to be here with you at this time. Thank you again for taking out of your time. Mr. Blue, tell us about your uh, casino tour. What, what, what's going on with you? What are you going, uh, uh, yes, what you we, doing? We, yeah, it's just called the Ride and Drive Tour. Okay. Um, I partnership with the Fannie Lou Hamer Cancer Foundation. Mm -hmm. And the goal is to go throughout all the casinos throughout the country. Uh, okay. We're here right now today. We're here in the resort in Tuna, Mississippi. Yes. Uh, September 30th, every other month, we're going to be going to other casinos. We're going to be oh, in Vicksburg, okay. Lady Luck. Oh, okay. And the goal is to raise awareness, put uh, Fannie Lou Hamer Cancer Foundation in a light because they're they building that. Uh, multi-billion, uh, mo uh, not multi-billion, sorry. Yeah. They built a major facility in my hometown for oh, cancer research. And where's your hometown? In Ruba, Mississippi. Yeah, it was the and, Delta boy. Yes, sir. And, yeah. and it's, it's a blessing to be a part of such cause. Yeah. A close friend of mine passed recently, my grandfather. Uh, a lot of people close to me died of cancer. Yeah. And so I said that I was going to use my gift, my talent, and my energy and put mm -hmm. it to a good cause. And build, build, build. Yeah. Yes, well, that's what it. That's what it's all about. So uh, I know you uh, are working hard. Who uh, influences uh, you in the uh, music business? Oh uh, man, like again, uh, I love Bobby Rush. Like I said, Bobby Rush. He's inspired. Yeah. Inspired. Yeah. Uh, the work ethics, uh, how disciplined he is. I watched his size. I watched how he always remained the same size. Yeah. I Meaning he taking good care of himself. Oh, um, absolutely. Sam yeah, no Cook, about that. Bobby Bland. You see a lot of guys in the group that's playing. Sidney Ford, Ivory Joe, Rick Dolan played with Bobby many years. Oh, so you got some Bobby Bland's uh, play on the stage. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. I admire yeah, the guys. All right. um, it's so much great talent that's been out here through the days. I just try to do my little part to, uh, you know, to do the right thing. Yeah, yeah. You're a mighty young fella to uh, to expect that kind of flavor in your music, you know, so... Uh, been through a lot. Yeah. Been through a lot. I've been doing it. Um, I put out People Don't Know It. I released my first record um, when I was like 18 years old. So I've been, I've, I've just seen it where I had to move out of my apartment, sleep in, out the car to produce my own music. Um, everything I've been so releasing. So you've been down through that. You know what all this my business is about. All of my music, majority of all my music, yeah. is self-funded off my work ethics and my, and, 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 and my, my mindset at the end of the day. And so I know I know that um, I'm utilizing my talent, but I have to have some sense to be able to make it work to yeah. sustain my living yeah. and provide, you know. So, But I think through the struggle, God always put me through. It strengthens me. Yeah. And it gives me it. It keeps me grounded and it gives me the force to persevere through this business. And so, through the grace of God, and I keep surrounding myself with good people, you know. Oh, yeah. Yes, sir. Yeah. 
Look, uh, we're going to take another break here, and we'll be right back. Stick and stay, don't go nowhere. From the Windy City, Chicago Blues, the debut album on Cody Records featuring JoJo Mary. His debut single, From the Inside. On Cody Records. It's a sad situation. Outlets. It's JoJo Mary. Yo Hits Radio, the internet party right in the palm of your hands. Yo Hits Radio, listen and win. Monica Savvy, the morning show, Slim Goody, the afternoon, and the night cruiser flows from 6 p.m. to midnight. It's Yo Hits Radio, blues, gospel, neo soul, R&B, pop, and jazz. Get your app today. It's Yo Hits Radio. Join us and jam. It's so hard. We're back with J.R. Blue. I tell you, Mr. Blue, look, we're going to wrap this thing up. We appreciate you uh, stopping you, in. I know you got to get ready for stage for your big show tonight. But uh, tell us, uh, how do your fans get in touch uh, with you? Uh, where you going? Uh, what's coming on the scene with J.R. Blue? Uh, you, know, you know, now everybody can find me on Facebook, you know, right there. Uh, from from JR Blue, this is JRBLU. Um, we right there, JR Blue Music right there. Uh, you know, Facebook is a thing right now. Yeah. Uh, I want to say this new record is for sale. You know, you just download some of the now. So where can they get it at? Uh, from iTunes, Amazon. You can just Google the name of the song, Amazing, mm-hmm. and JRBLU, and all the information pop up. Oh, okay. okay. And I just I just want to say I thank everybody and. It's a blessing to be able to sing and do, you know, put your gift out and people can connect to it. So I'm, for, I'm forever thankful. And, and, you and are, I just want everybody to, to support me and, and, uh, and I'm going to do the right thing. Well, I like the CD. I like the And uh, I thank you all for CD always. Every time, you know, every time I come down to Memphis, yeah. I call you. You, you know, all the roads, all the streets, and you get yeah. crazy. Those little brother, small yeah. things go a long way. So I'm yeah. forever uh, thankful for what you We're going to keep working with yeah. you. And, uh, Hey, you don't be a stranger now. We want to see your face back in the oh, place. Yeah, yeah. And we want you to uh, tell your friends about us. But more than anything, you partnered with the uh, Fannie Lou uh, mm-hmm. Foundation. Mm-hmm. And you're going to be working with them. Mm-hmm. Casino to Casino. Casino to Casino. Oh, okay. Mm-hmm. Putting on major shows. Well, Mr. Blue, thank you again. And well, I thank you. And uh, I tell you. And this is the, this show here is the show. Well, I this is the show. Flowers, this brother. is the show. I appreciate show. it. We are working hard to get this thing off of the ground. You know, so uh, you're taking out of your time this evening to share with us. And baby, this is the man himself, Mr. J.R. Blue. What's your record company name? It is Capital A Records. Capital A Records. Capital A Records have been there since way back in the day. Even though you know you said I don't know nothing about back in the day. Yeah, <laughs> young man talking yeah, about back in the day. When, uh, when I was right about 19, I started. So how old were you when you did your uh, first, first record? record? First record, uh, sorry, I was 21. Because I released that record when I was 21. And you were living here in, uh, in the depth and the end. I was living in Ruben. I left Ruben and went to Atlanta. Left Atlanta, went to Tuskegee. From Tuskegee, worked in uh, Alabama market, went back to Atlanta. And things when I came, I learned the game, you know, from, from I was out there just doing street vending, making sales, yeah. selling clothes, all merchandise. And I learned sales. I came back over to the retail store and I, and I, and I came back here because this is where it's at. Yeah. Mm-hmm.